pretty windy out there guys 7 to 10 and gusting you see the clouds are moving around doesn't look as bad now but they're they're hauling okay looks like uh, build time what's happening guys yeah it's kind of windy out there it's about eight nine mile an hour gusting up to about 11 or 12 so uh, we're gonna take the time I guess and it's still pretty cold so I'm gonna put this this mall together a uh, couple things I wanted to say before I th start throwing it together I, uh, in, in the unboxing, I mentioned this one would take a little bit longer to do. I don't think it's going to be the case. I was more as looking at it and looking at the parts. The screws are all identical. The only two oddballs are, uh, and I thought these would be for the floats, but just the lock nuts are for the floats. Those little th three little screws, and only two of them I think are needed, and that's for uh, the tail section. Other than that, it's a no-brainer all the same screws so I think should go get it pretty good oh and they're uh, machine head screws too which I kind of liked so as far as taking it apart and putting it together uh, for the wings and stuff like that I may replace these with good quality because I know these don't last real long I'll put the rest of it together with them but for the wings I think I'm going to get some uh, some good metric uh, hex nuts uh, hardened steel you know something good that's not going to strip that way I can take the wings off and on anytime I want to in a snap and I've got already got it already got a place this can hang up perfect right next to my carbon Z Cessna. Alright? So anyway, no you couldn't see my head. But yeah, we're gonna hang this thing right up next to the carbon Z Cessna and uh, I'll be able to pop the wings off and lay it beside just like I did the the carbon Z. Alright, so we'll get this thing going and uh, like I said, uh, it's all screws. Oh the other thing I wanted to show you guys was that all the inlays and all the stuff have brass threaded deals in them. So they're all, you know, except for that tail section. Well, the tail, se actually the tail section, it takes those, uh, takes those too. All right, so maybe those other screws are for the, uh, uh, the float set. I may be, I may have to stand corrected on that. But, uh, Pretty cool. All brass inserts and stuff and like that. Even yeah, even back here looks threaded. So that's good. Good deal. Alright, let's get this thing rolling and uh see you in a short.
Okay there guys, there you have it, that's the Maw M7 from E-Flight, it's at 1.5. And, uh, I'm sorry, my camera was messing up for a second there. 1.5, I did not do the floats yet, I want to do the, uh, Clear, uh, clear gorilla tape on the bottom first before I put them together. The other spare parts, like I said, were just for the, uh, uh, in fact, some of those long screws too. You don't use them all on this one. Um, and there are a couple of extras as well as that they, they give to you too. So uh, if you find a couple of them, they're a little shallow like I did. Uh, just pop one out with, with one that's a little bit deeper and you shouldn't have a problem. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. I can't wait to get this one in the air either. It is an AS3X and uh, it's uh, supposed to be a good time. Thanks for watching.